Did you know that the largest artillery weapon in human history was created by German engineers and used during World War II? This is the legendary Schwerer Gustav, a colossal railway cannon developed in the 1930s under the leadership of engineer Erich Müller at the Krupp Company. Schwerer Gustav was impressive in its size, weighing 1,350 tons and measuring 47.3 meters in length. Its shells, weighing up to seven tons, could penetrate concrete and steel at distances of up to 47 kilometers. The cannon was designed to destroy the powerful French fortifications of the Maginot Line, but was not ready by the 1940 campaign. Its first combat operation took place only in 1942. In June 1942, Schwerer Gustav was deployed during the siege of Sevastopol on the Crimean Peninsula. The weapon was used to destroy key defensive targets, including underground ammunition depots located about 30 meters below sea level. Preparing the cannon for firing required about 500 people and several weeks of work, making its use extremely complex and resource intensive. In addition to the main team of 500 people, a significant number of auxiliary personnel were involved in maintaining and protecting Schwerer Gustav. The total number of troops involved in its operation exceeded 4,000 people. To protect the cannon from air attacks, two anti-aircraft battalions equipped with 88mm and 20mm guns, totaling about 400 men, were deployed. Additionally, the cannon site included a field post office and even a mobile brothel for the personnel. Interestingly enough, the Krupp company, which created the Schwerer Gustav, still exists today. Once known for its weaponry, it now manufactures entirely peaceful products. For instance, your coffee machine at home might very well be made by Krupp, a striking contrast left to us by history.